so it's morning one. Trey's excited. Are you excited? Am I? Yeah. Mildly excited for a Monday. Um, there's a bazillion birds down here in this room. This is one of the roof sites on this piece, so, so there's a pretty good chance we're gonna at least have a shot today. I'm gonna quote him on that one, but we're just gonna hang out up high. Wait for these toms to kind of work out of the bottom and then uh, go on with the reefer and see if we can't make something happen. We'll see, we've never reefed this early in the year. I um, don't know how they're gonna respond, but I think, uh, I think we can get close. I haven't heard me go this morning. Mm -mm. Those birds did exactly what they're supposed to. We just got the reaper to where they could see it and I just started flapping the wings on it. It came in the heartbeat, right? Perfect setup. He was probably, I don't even know how far he He was like I five, remember. yeah, he was nothing. But I couldn't see through the grass enough to see well. I thought I got a better line on him, but it's a little back, but I don't see him well, making arrow it. Sticking right out below the ear. Yeah, I mean, it's a, he's. He didn't look like he was doing too good when he went over the ridge. No. We're getting found, but that's cool. That wasn't the first time we actually went on. He uh, he went on through, I think, with the group, didn't he? Yeah. He, and by the time I got there. He done, was up here by the time you got to right That's what I figured. Yeah. But those other ones came up top, and I just I haven't ever tried that. But if, you're, if you have to be stationary like I was there, I had to be set up, just take the wings and flap them. And man, it literally, I started flapping, they just turned on a dime. Alright, so we were gonna reap our second bird and got close to it, but then this giant storm's coming, so we uh, popped up a vine real quick right by the roost trees, and we're just gonna try to cut them off for now. We've still got the reaper with us. Uh, we've got some avian hen decoys out too, but we're just gonna see what happens. These, we know these birds are gonna come back down here. This rain has just passed through, but had some hail in it, a lot of thunder, so uh, I don't know what's gonna happen. We may shoot one out of the blind, or we may just have Austin film out of the blind. But we're gonna sit here till they show up because we know this is where they're coming. So there's birds coming in from all different angles. It's super, super thick. A lot of cedars down here, but they'll, uh, they should just pop out and kind of mill around here before they go up. Hopefully, we'll be able to show you guys some numbers, but we'll see what happens. 